Nigeria's new president, Bola Tinubu, has announced an end to the era of subsidy payment and fuel. Tinubu said the 2023 budget made no provision for fuel subsidy and more so, subsidy payment was no longer justifiable. He also said that the funds will be channeled into improving infrastructure and other areas to strengthen the economy. Subsidy. Unfortunately, the budget that have glimpsed before I slim of and what I've had is that no provision is there for fair subsidy. Subsidy is gone. Subsidy can no longer justify an ever increasing cost and a wake of dry resources. We shall instead be channel whatever support to fund the better investment. He also promised to remodel the economy to bring about growth as well as develop the growth domestic products through job creation. Economy. We target a GDP not less than six percent growth. We end to accomplish all of this by taking the following step. Budgetary reform. Stimulating the economy without gendering inflation. Industrial policy. To utilize the full range of domestic, domestic manufacturing and lessen import dependency. The electricity will become more accessible and affordable to businesses and homes alike. Our generation should gather double and transmission and distribution network must improve significantly. Our government will continue to take proactive steps such as championing a credit culture to discourage corruption while strengthening the effectiveness and effectiveness efficiency of the various and corruption agencies. Security shall be top priority of our administration because neither prosperity nor justice have prevailed and made insecurity and violence. To effectively tackle this, we shall reform both our security doctrine and its architecture. We shall invest more in our security personnel and in it means more than an increase in number. We shall provide better training, equipment, pay, and far better. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.